Good morning! It's January 22nd, 2021, and we welcome you to Jake's Bounty! I'm in the garage, good dog. Friday, uh, I was going to say afternoon, I guess it is afternoon, it's 11.30 a.m., technically still in the morning, but it is the afternoon, we'll go ahead and go with that, um, like I said, it is a Friday, it is January the 22nd, 2021, and I'm losing my breath because I'm so fat and I don't do anything, <laughs> all right, uh, I'm going to go ahead and thank the music today that was provided by, uh, Possession by Cream, that was their sixth album. We have Come For Your Children, volume six, uh, back released in 2013. And that song was entitled, oh, Touch My Cock. Great song right there, great song. All right, we also have some great sponsors. We have Regeneralize, that's right, the new uh, anti-anxiety, antidepressant medication that your doctor must approve of on. But you can tell them all about how your life sucks and you want to take this because maybe it'll help you. But it also gives you side effects, including black stool, uh, blood stool. Um, no, that's not a punk band name, but it could be blood stool. I like that. Anyway, they also give you uh, my feeling like you might want to hurt yourself or others. You might have other side effects, including nausea, dizziness, um, psychosis, uh, vertigo. Parkinson's disease, and many more. But hey, you might actually enjoy your life, or maybe not. But anyway, mention to your doctor, regionalize. And finally, leaving Las Vegas. We'll have a scene from it later on. I'll do another little scene from it, uh, reenact it. You know what I'm talking about. Okay, let's go ahead and get to my bounty right now. So it's a pretty good sized bounty. Uh, Got a little bit of this and that, you know, everything under the hat. Here we go. Uh, Sprite right there, okay. Um, soul, chalata, chalada. That's with the uh, onions and the, uh, I, I guess that's a clam right there and it's the tomato. If that's a clam, let me know right there in the picture below. All right, uh, Mike's Hard Lemonade. This is Mike's Strawberry Lemonade, Hard Strawberry Lemonade. Pepsi, right there. And uh, Izzy, Sparkling Clemente, or maybe it's just Iz. All right, reminds me of the band Jizz. <laughs> and Modelo Chalata. All right, that's a mango flavor one, I think. Mango and chili, yeah. All right, so put these back. Here we go. Oh, left a little mess. What do we do? We wipe it up, and we're good to go. All right, I want to show you a little item I found today. Um, not regeneralized, <laughs> but I found a knife. Yeah, that's right. See if I can flick it out. Um, earlier it was just flung out. Okay. Hold on. I guess I should have done this earlier. <laughs> I know there's probably like a little way to do it. Um, yeah, I'm probably going to kill myself doing this. Shit. Uh, fuck. Okay, you know what? I'm going to figure this out, but as we do this, I'm going to also let you know about the news. Okay, um, four have been displaced. Sorry, 
Four displaced after a fire destroys Fresno County home. Uh, this was on Clarkson to Wolf, Highway 43, before 7 a.m. Motorcycle uh, rider was killed in Central Fresno uh, today, actually, at 6 a.m. A pickup truck pulled out in front of them. Uh, both directions of West Avenue are blocked between Brown and Michigan Avenue, so be aware of that if you're in that direction. All right, Fresno police officer possibly exposed the fentanyl yesterday. Lucky. No, just kidding. Uh, the officer said he felt dizzy and lightheaded after he had an incident with a crash. Um, it was on Shaw and Brawley, and it looked like the uh, driver of the car, a 30-year-old man who caused a crash, was intoxicated. And they did find fentanyl on him as well. The hazmat uh, team came down and cleared out the scene, and uh, the officer expected to be okay. All right, storms will bring rain to the valley and snow to Sierra. All right, they will bring it over the next week. Uh, there was some rain today, just a little bit. Luckily, I had my uh, cap on um, and a little jacket as well. Today's uh, low right now will be 54 degrees and high will be 56 degrees. All right, what do I do to get this son of a bitch open? It looks like there's more than just one knife. I guess I just should have had the blade always open, right? Uh, I don't know. There was dirt in it, so I guess I saved it, but... Uh, and you can hook it up to your jeans, but fuck it. All right, I'm going to go ahead and get to... Uh, 309 Games, Puzzles, and Trivia Questions. All right, um... All the items in each list have something in common except one thing. Your job is to figure which item is the odd man out and why. Okay, first one, Goldfinger. Live and let die. Study in Scarlet, Dr. No. I'm going to say study in the Scarlet is the one that's different. Um, Alex Rodriguez, Derek Jeter. Tom Brady, Ryan, Randy Johnson, Jason Giambi. Giambi, excuse me. I'm going to say Tom Brady because the rest of them are baseball players. Snowflake, elephant, tree, automobile. Well, snowflake, elephant, tree, automobile. Hmm. I'm going to come back to that one. C, L, V, X, and Z. Um, say Z. No, say those are um, Roman numerals. Flounder, shrimp, lobster, crab. Flounder, shrimp, lobster, crab. I'm going to say flounder because all those shrimp, lobster, crab, I think, are all novelists. Uh, Meg, Joe, Mary, Beth, Amy. Meg, Joe, Barry, Meth. Amy, I don't think, belong. I think that was a little women. I'm not sure. URL, HTTP, PDF, ESP, uh, WWW. ESP does not belong. Berlin, Brussels, Bonn, Baden, Baden. Or Baden Baden. I'm going to say Baden Baden does not belong. On Golden Pond, the Devil Wars Prada, Kramer versus Kramer and Sophie's Choice. Um, so the Devil Wars Prada was the one that's not uh, as odd men out. Huntington, uh, West Virginia, Trenton, New Jersey, Baltimore, Maryland, Richard, Virginia. Um, West Virginia, Trenton. I'm going to say. Trenton, New Jersey is not part of that. The odd man out. Um, three, I, I don't not know. I'm just going to pass on three. So, well, go ahead and go to 133 right now. Um, oh, wow, I turned right to it. It's uh, luck. Odd man out. The first one is a study in Scarlet is the odd man out. And the second one is Tom Brady is the odd man out. Number three, uh, Snowflake is the odd man out. Why? Because they all other ones have trunks. Elephant has a trunk. A tree has a trunk. Automobile has a trunk. Oof. Z is the odd man out for number four because all the letters are Roman numerals except for Z. Flounder is the odd man out because the flounder is the only fish. Uh, the other are crustaceans. I said nautilus, but crustaceans, whatever. Still got it right. Mary is the uh, odd woman out. The others are the four little sisters and Mary. Louise Little Women. So Mary is the uh, one I messed up on, huh? Okay. 
So that's uh, two I missed. All right, and let me see if I can find it again. ESP is the odd man out, number seven. Number eight, Brussels is the odd man out. Shit. So there I miss three now. Um, on Golden Pond is the odd man out. It's the only movie that did not star on Meryl Streep. Shit. And Trenton is the odd man out. It's the only city in the list north of Mason Disks and Line. Fuck. Alright, so I missed four out of ten. That's a six. That's a D. Not good. I thought I was going to do better. A lot better, in fact. But what you going to do, huh? I mean, this knife thing didn't work out for me, and not much else says either. <laughs> but let's go ahead and get to the funky movie soundtrack of the week. Uh, we did this last week with the uh, movie soundtrack Car Wash and the band Rose Royce. Um, this uh, week we're going to do it with Curtis Mayfield and his uh, third album, Superfly. It was a funky movie soundtrack. It was a soundtrack for the movie Superfly, obviously. Um, um, it's a very good movie. If you haven't seen Go See It. It's about a drug dealer in the 1970s who is um, well, a badass cat. Um, but it's also, the song is about, well, not the dangers of using drugs and um, just all around everything about it, okay? Um, the soundtrack would end up having two million selling singles. Uh, Freddy's Dead. Went to number two in the R&B charts and number four in the pop. And the title track, uh, Superfly, went to number five in the R&B and number eight on the pop. One of the few soundtracks that outgrossed the film that was represented. Wow. So the soundtrack actually did better than the film. Huh. Uh, let's see. After the success of this, uh, Curtis Mayfield did many more movie soundtracks, including Claudine in 1960, uh, 1974. Excuse me. Let's do it again in the following year. Sparkle in 1976, uh, Short Eyes in 1978, and many others uh, later. Okay, um, this uh, album, uh, movie soundtrack, uh, Superfly, was ranked number 69, 69, on Rolling Stone's list of 500 greatest LPs of all time, all right? In 2019, it was selected by the Library of Congress for preservation in the National Recording Registry for being culturally historic or aesthetically significant. So, wow. Um, who would have thunk it? You know, uh, the song Superfly about, uh, you know, uh, a pimp drug dealer um, uh, would be a part of the National Registry of History and preserved. All right. Um, Unfortunately, Curtis Mayfield would be paralyzed in 1990 when a light would fall on him during performance uh, in Flatbush, Brooklyn. Um, sadly, in 1999, he would pass away from type 2 diabetes at age 57. Uh, but there is lots of great music that he left behind, and you can go, uh, you know, look at it, um, you know, at media platforms or um, any record stores. Um, Spotify, YouTube, you know, just look up Curtis Mayfield and you'll see it. Uh, Superfly will be the first thing that pops up, but uh, I, you know, go look for more besides just Superfly. I'm going to try and get this knife one more time. All right, um, if I can get this knife, I'll let you guys know and I'll upload it. It's a big freaking deal. All right, but now here's a scene. Well, me intro. uh, reenacting a scene from Leaving Las Vegas. Are you working tonight? You know, like, uh, you know, are you working tonight? I pay you $500 for your services. Just come back to my room for one hour. That's all I'm asking. Do you want to, you want to go? Okay. All right, all right. By the way, I'm great sex. Okay, that was a scene from Leaving Las Vegas uh, when Nicolas Cage uh, uh, was introduced to the Elizabeth Shue character um, on the streets of Las Vegas and asked her if she would come back to his room with him for $500. I, 
I would. Just to be Nicolas Cage, you know, in the same room as him for an hour. I mean, I would try to put up the whole sex thing, and I'd run around the whole bed and shit, and uh, just do whatever I can. Go to the bathroom and say, like, oh, I gotta get all sexy for you, and, you know, and then take a mean dump for, like, a half hour or some shit, and then come out and be like, oh, I'm sick, you know, could you do a scene from uh, Con Air for me instead, and, you know, you know you don't even have to pay me. Just let me hang out with Nicolas Cage. That'd be a good movie right there. Called Leaving Nicolas Cage. Because after an hour and a half, you're fucking annoyed of him, my bad. <laughs> All right, but... Uh, that's going to do it for today's show. Um, I know kind of the item that I had, uh, you know, didn't work. But sometimes you get that. It's a knife, okay? It's a piece of shit one. Um, you can get on Jake's Bounty right now if you type in the word knife for three ninety nine. dollars Just kidding. Um, but we have Leaving Las Vegas. That's right. It's the movie of the week just for the rest of the week. And it's uh, 50 cents at uh, Ray's Video uh, for VHS, $1 for DVD. Okay? Also, Regeneralize. Uh, great new doctors approve. Uh, medication, you have to get your doctor's approval of it, of course, but it may help you with anti-anxiety, antidepressant, and it might give you some, uh, you know, side effects of uh, flashbacks, you know, from NOM, even though you weren't there. Uh, like I said, uh, you'll get uh, really bad teeth, like meth mouth, even though you're not doing meth, uh, black stool, uh, blood in the stool. Um, also you'll get, you know, dizziness, nausea, not that I've taken this or anything, but I just heard this. Um, also, go ahead and get the stovetop grill right now, Jake's Bounty, $9.99 right here. Make you feel like you're cooking outside, but you're inside. Hot dogs, uh, hamburgers, steak, all that good stuff, shish kebab. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and let you know that Monday's show will be, uh, Music 101, what happened this day in music. Also, we'll have my bounty. We'll have the news. We'll have some more music you never heard of. Maybe more Possession by Cream, like this song right here. This is the rest of the song, um, Touch My Cock, from the album uh, We Have Come For Your Children, back in 2013, all right? So right now, we'll take you out with that. You guys be good to yourself, and be good to each other, and have a good weekend, all right? I can reach your face, I can read your face. Jake's Bounty was filmed at Fornicate Yourself Records Production 2021. You can follow him on Facebook. Just don't follow him getting cans. You won't stand a chance. Also, you can go to his website, go to his channel, leave him a like, leave him a comment, and please subscribe.